What's good folks, Ruds here. We're gonna continue this torrid week of reviews with a, another soap review. Australian Private Reserve Fresca. Uh, as you will recall from my last video reviewing Australian Private Reserve, I consider them the uh, barrister man of the Southern Hemisphere. They hand make all their uh, scents from the ground up. Zero pre-blending from them is done. Um, using only essential oils where possible and uh, they really focus on quantity excuse me quality over quantity and it shows in their uh, scent uh, notes and accords that they come up with good news is these guys are now available in the US not only at maggardrazors.com but also now at groomatorium inc Links for both of those third-party resellers will be below if you care to uh, partake in one of these scents. All right, so Fresca is APR's take on Italian classic Colonia type scent. And when I say it's a take, it is not a uh, dupe or intended to be a dupe of the... Uh, widely popular ADP Colonia scent. Uh, this was, as I mentioned earlier, handmade from the ground up. Um, it's bright, it's clean, and it's very crisp because of the citrus notes. Speaking of notes, it features neroli, lemon, bergamot, sweet orange, rosewood, rosemary, jasmine, musk, sandalwood, and patchouli. The scent strength is mid-strong, both off of the container and remains as such through the lathering process. Similarly scented soaps that come to mind for me would be the uh, Katie's Bubbles Confiant limited edition, edition scent as well as the uh, Sterling Soap Co. Piacenza. All right, uh, another broken record type review in terms of performance. I've spoken about it several times here in the last few months, but uh, APR is a top 15 contender for me no problem it's above average to very good in all metrics including lather density lather volume slickness residual slickness as well as post shave By my recent account, I can't think of a uh, international artisan that has a better soap base out there right now, uh, which is a testament to the company's commitment to quality over quantity. And for similar experiences with the soap base, I definitely suggest you check out Tallow and Steel or perhaps Chiseled Face Crematorium. All right, folks, we're back with some uh, final thoughts on APR Fresca. Absolutely phenomenal head and uh, face shave today. This scent is uh, really going to please a lot of people. If you're at all a fan of the uh, classic Italian colonial type fragrance, you need to check this out. It's uh, in the same family, as I mentioned earlier, but it's not the same in any manner. So you'll really be able to enjoy this uh, as you would the others without feeling like you're overlapping. I've done quite a few reviews lately of APR and I've uh, failed to mention how good their aftershaves are. Um, extremely good face feel, skin feel, uh, after you apply them, it's kind of got a little bit of a tackiness to it. I think probably due to the uh, aloe juice in it. 
uh, but it, it leaves my skin soft and uh, moisturized for hours after and the uh, scent strength on it has uh, rather long staying power so another plus one for them if you will check out APR Fresca if you're at all interested their other offerings again are available in the US as well as always thumbs up the video if you like it Comment below if you have anything to say, and if you haven't already subscribed, please do so. See ya.